It's time for Aging in Style. We're here today with Dr. Cheryl Hasegawa. Thanks so much for joining us here today. We appreciate you, you being here. Nice All right, so here. we're talking about the importance of having a primary care doctor. So tell us what role the primary care doctor plays in someone's overall health. Okay, yes, the primary care doctor, a lot of times we are here um, to help patients coordinate mm -hmm. and navigate their health. Um, a good part of what we do helps patients um, in preventative care. Uh, identifying maybe some risk factors that would help improve their overall health. Fantastic. So, yeah. so what if someone just goes to see specialists for different issues? You know, is that something that's enough? Well, specialists certainly play a very, very important mm -hmm. role in patients' health care. But oftentimes, um, for instance, I'll have patients that come in, they know something's going on, they're not quite sure where to turn to. And this is where primary care is very important. We can help patients figure out just what's going on, maybe get the appropriate appropriate testing um, and some start some treatments and then from there if needed to see to the appropriate specialist so um, we can help patients navigate that without jumping all over the place un unnecessarily. Yeah so. the patient probably doesn't want to do that either. Yeah. So with the end of the year coming up fast it's a great time to use your flexible spending account or take advantage of a completed deductible. Is there still time to set up a new patient exam? Oh absolutely. Um, there's no time like the present really and at this time we also do encourage people um, to get in and get their vaccinations mm -hmm. um, so this is a good time to also get in to see their primary care doctor I think to establish with somebody is very important um, not only for the overall care but it's nice to get some sort of um, relationship with your doctor yeah. where you're able to feel more comfortable talking with them about issues. Um, somebody who really understands you, your family, what's going on with you. I mean, it's a truly a holistic approach. It's not just about the disease process, but there's a lot involved in our care. It's a relationship too that way. It is a relationship, yes. You gotta yeah. find the right yeah. one. And speaking of, how can you find a doctor, a primary care doctor at McLaren? Oh, well, actually most uh, hospital systems do have uh, referral um, sites that you mm -hmm. can go on. At McLaren, you can to sign up to mclaren.org and find a provider and from there you're able to navigate and find a primary care doctor or even a specialist like cardiologist if you need to. We're here, they have excellent providers um, that can be here to help you when you need it. So. Fantastic. So there's still time to get in to see your doctor. Absolutely. And find one you have a good relationship with. Right. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for being here thank today. You. Such a pleasure. And if you, you at home would like some more information on today's topic, head on over to the Aging and Style page on WNE. Com.